My name is Peter Steigerwald. I am the co-owner of Aspen Comics with Frank Master Morrow. And uh, I do quite a bit here. Everything from uh, coloring to drawing to writing to logo design to basically anything we need to do to keep us on our feet. I got my start the way a lot of people try to and hope to uh, through portfolio submissions um, and uh, samples back in 94, ages and ages ago. I uh, went up to San Diego and actually, after sending off several submissions to many different companies and getting rejection letters or non-responses, in 1994 I went up to the San Diego Convention and showed my portfolio around and was hired by a studio there and that's when I began my career. I didn't really have a dream job. In fact, I resisted even going into art. You know, being a teenager, you didn't want to do what everybody else was telling you you should do. And so I resisted even being an artist until almost my senior year of high school until my friend pointed out that you can actually make money doing comics and doing this kind of stuff. So I did, um, and then missed the giant big money boom by two years. So we scrape out a living, but you know, we do okay. A misconception about the comic industry is that it is just for kids. It doesn't include uh, adults. We're writing for grown-ups. We write complete stories. We try to tell advanced and exciting stories. You know, I mean, our, our stories are complex. Uh, our artwork is the best artwork in the industry. And we gear what we do for a wide range of audiences. It's not for little kids. And another misconception is that comics is just for boys. Comics is not just for boys. Uh, a large portion of our audience is, is female. Um, and uh, we pride ourselves in our strong female characters and the fact that they take a lead role. Many of our books feature them more than prominently. They're the star, they're the main driving point of the story. Um, and we're proud of the fact that we empower women and do that through our books. all time. <clears throat> um, you know what, I I really like Fathom. I mean, it's one of our books and maybe it sounds like I, I, have, I have a bias, but something about what Mike created and what he captured in that book and its connection to the sea and how he portrays the characters um, really was magic. I mean, and the first book is just, it's, it, the whole series is so wonderfully done and the world of it is, is great. I mean, um, ask me again in a couple of years and hopefully I'll save my book, but right now it's fabulous.